Yeah. You ready to do some damage? Yes. <laughs> Come on, Callie! I think the one selfish thing that I have, at least, is being able to call the families and tell them that Sunshine on a Rainy Day and we're the founders and we receive their application and we're going to come out and check out their homes. Good job, Callie! Oh, look at that! Oh, look at that. <laughs> and as soon as we met Callie and her family and told them you know, that we wanted to help them, she just started crying and she was just so grateful. And her personality, which everyone, you can tell in the first second you meet her, is just amazing. That's what you get for not what I'm you. And she just makes you want to be a better person and help so many more because she's just awesome. We found out Callie had Williams syndrome when she was two months old after being transported to the hospital several times for choking episodes. And it's uh, a genetic um, disorder. It's a deletion of a chromosome. And she has um, seizures and um, left-sided weakness. We just went to the doctor yesterday and she um, had another mini stroke. They told us that 99.9% .9 that she would never make it through surgery because of what her problem was with her heart, where the narrowing was, causes the sudden death with Williams Syndrome children. Callie made it through the surgery. It's a, gonna be a long road, but she's just our sunshine. I think one of the things that makes our organization different is we bring the construction expertise so that the families, I feel like, can trust us to come in and take care of whatever construction aspect they need. Just from experience, we've learned what kind of heights work for certain situations. There's a standard for the door widths, but ultimately we build the house and make the room for the family, for the child, to make sure they get exactly what they need to make their life easier. We are pretty much living in these houses when we work on them and we become part of their family and they become part of ours and it's kind of just fun to even like show up in the house early in the morning and the kids running to see us. It's awesome. I'm like, dang, is that really, is that really Pete Rainey? <laughs> <laughs> So this just explains to you guys, this is the safari therapy room. Andy is the world famous muralist that's helping us. Sunshine on Every Day is a great organization that allows me to kind of do two things, which combine my passion for painting with helping out kids and bringing a smile to their face. It's just a labor of love. I mean, I love to paint. That's my gift and my talent, I feel like, that God's given me. And then uh, I've been called to share that with others. You can have little money or big money and it all has the same blessing at the end. I never, ever, seen a charity like this, where the love, the support, the unconditional love, the paying it forward, I've been involved in a lot of charities and I've never seen the commitment that we have to these families, that it's from start to finish and more. I cry at every reveal. Um, it's it kind of a mixed feeling because at first it's like a kid, you know, waiting for Christmas because you you're so excited, you're like excited about the design, you know it turned out like great, and you know that they're gonna love it, and you're just waiting for them to arrive. We cover a lot of bad in this world when we're reporters. We see a lot of bad stuff, but then you hook up with a charity like Sunshine on a Rainy Day, and man, you see the good in this world and you see families coming together and families helping one another and companies that are not just out for money that are, that are willing to help their communities. I mean, that makes it all worthwhile. I feel like crying, <laughs> but I can't because I just don't make it all. <laughs> Ready to see Mr. Dave? Yeah. Dave Nazaroff coming all the way from Nyack, New York to Gainesville. <laughs> Ride to Give and Sunshine on a Rainy Day, and I feel like it's a movement of people helping other people. Hey, and I'm just happy to be part of something special. Okay, Callie, you ready? Uh huh. Let's get started. I love it. 
having something for Callie to look forward to and to see her reaction and to make her as happy as y'all did means the world. It means more than you'll ever know. Words can never say how happy I am. My God, how adorable! I can't. <laughs> Wait till you see the jungle. Ready? Welcome to your jungle. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> We're thankful we have met such wonderful people that care so much about our little girl that we care so much about. I mean, when we started the charity, you know, our thought was brighten kids' lives and paint the rooms, maybe give them some furniture, things like that. But we quickly realized that the things we do in these people's lives is really, really making an impact. So when we make a big ball pit, you know, like, like to do, like at Cali's, we made a seven by seven ball pit. You know, and you see her, the first thing she does and goes to the room and jumps the ball pit. And you can see all her body just relax. You know, you, you realize, you know, yeah, it's fun and it's cool and everything, but it's a real therapy tool and it, it, it helps her. At the end of the day, when you come to the reveal, it's that, that feeling that you get and you realize, like, this is why we do it. This is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> How in the world did you do all this in this little bit of time you had? We really thank you so much. Thank you.